<laughs> Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. It is time now for our full circle. We wanted to bring our sister Kim Coles yes. over to the table yes. to hang Yay. out with us. Yeah, fun, fun, fun. Okay, so you're not not only a gifted comedian, actress, but you're also a life coach. Yes. You know, and I have a, thank you. I am. Yeah. Thank you. I received that. <laughs> yes. Well, I've lived. I'm, this is 56 and a half. Come yeah. on. Oh, oh, beautiful. Thank you. Yeah. Have a moment. Yeah. Yes. Have a moment. Yes. Yes. And, and, and I've lived, and I have stories to tell, yeah. and I have yeah. stories to help other people with. Yeah. So my thing is, is that I love the power of story, and mm -hmm. that everything that has happened to you has actually happened for, for you, you to Ooh. transform. You. Write that down. Write that down. Yes. Write it down. Write it okay. <laughs> what if everything that's happened to you has happened for you? Yes. So yes. the good stuff, the yummy, the yucky, and what if you're able to just take it and reframe it and go, these things happened for me to heal myself and to help and heal others. And is that what happens at your workshop? You love your story actually, workshop. So I have a, a workshop that I, I'm taking around the country and having one here uh, in Atlanta, October 28th. Yes. yes. Got yes. that in. Um, <laughs> it's called the Love Your Story Workshop. So I take people through a series of exercises that help you unlock the, the jewels that are inside mm. your stories mm -hmm. and help you see that there's beauty and, and ups and downs and, and ways that you can, again, work through healing them yourselves and you have no idea who you can help yes. and, and take along on the journey. So it's about lifting as we climb yes. and doing it all together. I love it. I love yeah. that. I think you all would like climb. that. Yes. I, you would like I that. like yes. how there's quotes climb. attached to Yes, quotes. Okay. So here, we, we have a quote that is, it, that is from the story. So here's the first one. It's, when you discover your story, you understand the essence of who you are and what you stand for. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Talk so to us have these experiences and we're just like, okay, just move on to the next thing and the next thing. But it's, it's about really discovering your story. <laughs> and I have a, I, this is my divine thing. I get the downloads to go, there's jewels in there, there's things that happen, there's connections in there and, and, and things that connect to the past and the, and, and the future and, mm -hmm. and, and all that. And I mm -hmm. hear that and I go, did you ever think about this in that story? Did yes. you ever think about oh, this means that, and then just take a look at it from a different perspective. Yeah, yeah. That's, so that's true. Perspective that's so true. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like a perspective, yeah. perspective, mining at your jewels. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh -huh. all, all the metaphors, yeah. all the metaphors. Well, here's another one, Kim, um, that um, I'm going to read a quote from you. It says, when you know your story, mm -hmm. you show up in your business and life with authenticity and credibility. Get yes. out of Dodge. Please. Uh, Somebody else <laughs> shout it right there. Please explain. My so God. it is about, what is, what is that one? When you oh. just <laughs> when, you find it, when, you look at when you know it, when you know your story. So here's the thing. Here's the thing. When I started sharing my story, so after Living Single was over, mm -hmm. um, I shopped through all of my money. I was so depressed and oh. so out of it and so disconnected with the world because I, you know, this cocoon of it, what you see on that show really was love and what I felt was love. Right. And I felt, and nothing, I was working a little bit afterwards, but nothing really felt the same. Yes. Yeah. And so I got severely depressed and my, the way I express my mm -hmm. depression is I shopped. I shopped mm -hmm. right through all of it. And it was coming back from that. By the way, this is before everybody fell down in 2008. I was waiting for y'all to catch up with me. Right. I was already there. Right. And it was just stepping out and going, I can't be broke and broken and hide anymore. Yeah. And I started sharing my story, and everything began to open up for me. Wow. I began to become more less about looking for another sitcom and more about just sharing my story mm -hmm. and bringing people along and going, yes. you two, you two, me too, let's all go through it together. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's yeah. good. Yeah. That's real yeah. good. That's all right, well, I have a Kimism too. Okay. <laughs> they are Kimisms, they are. Yes, yes. So, Kim, when you master your story, you captivate and attract your audience and compel your clients to work with you. This sounds like you're speaking straight to the business women out there. I am, and so I work with entrepreneurs, business owners. I say entrepreneurs and wantrepreneurs. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, performers, authors, speakers, coaches, to, tell, to help them understand that their story is the way you attract customers and clients and cash. Let's go mm -hmm. there. You know, people go on Instagram, just go buy my so-and-so, get my so-and-so. Well, the truth is if you give them the why, yeah. if you tell them why you started your business, they will be engendered, I love that word, mm -hmm. engendered to come and work with you, to want to work more with, mm -hmm. with you. Tell I me like your why. That. Tell me where you come from. Tell me the, the thing behind the thing. And mm -hmm. I'm like, ooh, that sounds like me. Mm -hmm. And also when we hear each other's stories, we see ourselves in mm -hmm. other, other stories. So Absolutely. you may have had an experience that's completely different from mine, but I look at you and go, could I ever have that much courage. Wow, she mm. made it. Maybe I can too. Yes. And so that's why yes. it's important to tell and share because you have no idea who you're going to Ooh. inspire. Right. I think yeah. that's kind of the same answer that you would deliver for this quote. When you mm -hmm. share your story, you educate, entertain, and empower others. Mm -hmm. And it works 
kind of the same it way. It works the same mm -hmm. way. And yeah. I teach people how to captivate their crowd, how to, mm -hmm. you know, get the attention of their yeah. audience. Yes. Yes. You told me to you, you, do the shoulders. shoulders. Get yes. the shoulders. Yes. Feel that mojo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. It's about shoulder. really just shoulder sharing shoulder what you with. have to share with others. You have no idea who you're going to help. Yeah. And like I said, help and heal yourself. It was healing for me to share. Listen, I was on a red carpet one time with Will Smith mm -hmm. with $27 to my name. Oh, and wow. I have to still stand like I belong. Chicken, 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 chicken. I do my own sound effects. Yeah, that was good. And I got $27. $27 yeah. in my name, am I, what am I worth now? And, and you know. Um, and that had to feel so empty at the time. It was, and especially mm -hmm. because in Hollywood, everybody's, you know, we're yeah. all hiding. Yeah. And I was like, mm -hmm. I can't hide no more. I, yeah. got, I got to give up the red bottom shoes because the red wears off when you walk. Well, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like, your, like your wallet Message. is bleeding. <laughs> like your wallet, if you can really afford them, get them, but it, like your wallet is bleeding. And I was like, I got to take mm -hmm. these to the consignment the red shop. red wears off when you walk. Thank you. Walk. Another That's chemism, write that down, write that down. Write that down. Like your wallet is bleeding. If you can really, if that's you can deep. really afford them, then go for it. Yeah. But, yeah. but that's oh, right. No. Go, 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 don't fight, lady. She just hit y'all so hard with that because <laughs> the red bottom is synonymous to money. Mm. It is. But if you really begin to walk into your purpose, mm -hmm. yes. That will shed off of you. That mm -hmm. money won't be your value. You'll be able to walk into yeah. who you truly yeah. are. Mm -hmm. and, and that's exactly what that. your story is. Yes. When did I'm you find on with that message? When did you find that you were walking on this oh. enlightenment? You, you, you are, you're an enlightened individual. Oh, there are very few you. people that are enlightened. Right. I feel that. Do you feel that you I, are? I, um, I'm on my journey, yeah. like everyone is. Yeah. I'm on a journey. Mm -hmm. um, I also discovered through therapy that I didn't have to be all the way on the top of the mountain, the mountaintop, to share and help other people. That's right. what I really right. mean by lift as you climb. Right. So whatever yes. lessons you learn, take people along with you. Oh my God! Yes. I wasn't already there. And I'm still, we're on a journey. We're all on a journey. Yes, yeah. we are. Mm -hmm. Forever. Yes. Yeah, forever. forever. And we have to share it. Yes, yeah. we have, have to share it. Share people it. are tied to your obedience, and I'm so glad you were obedient to your call. Oh my God! I got rid of my red bottoms, and now I wear Crocs. I love it. Everybody's get to hurt now. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Man, we can talk. Thank you, Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, so Kim will be teaching her Love Your Story workshop all over the country. Yes. She'll be in Atlanta on October the 28th. And don't forget to check her out at Atlanta Comedy Theater all weekend long. We loved you having a here.